Hello, it's January 20th, 2021. I'm here, it's Jay Shelton, our teacher at Monta Vista High School. I've uh, been there for 18 years now, uh, here at my condo in San Jose, and I want to talk about our R1 class, why you should take it, or if you're a parent, why your, your son or daughter should take it, or why I think they should take it. It is the art class along with ceramics that a freshman can take with no prerequisites. We consider it our survey class. Usually I teach several of them, often Ms. Johnson teaches them, sometimes someone else will. Um, so you're more likely not gonna get, you're more likely not are gonna get me next year if you take the class and possibly Ms. Johnson. So we call it the survey class because this is where we show you everything a little bit. We spent a lot of the early part of the class talk, teaching drawing. I teach drawing uh, thoroughly, how to observe, not just draw from your imagination. That comes later, right now, you know, early on, we want to get you to be able to look at things, interpret them, not how you think they look, but by what you really see, by breaking things apart, putting them together. Again, we start with the hand. The first few days go to the shoe. By the third week, you're looking at someone across from you and drawing a portrait. And most of our kids get it pretty well and do pretty well. And I'm putting some student samples up right there for you to see. Maybe I have to move a little, move for you to see right here. These were all done by freshmen in Art One. Don't think it's impossible. Uh, we, break, we break the drawing skills down very cleanly, very easily for you to follow, you pay attention, you'll get that far. So we go into full figure drawing, we go into gesture drawing, which are quick drawings, and we go into um, foreshortening, which is a technique. Then we start getting into color. Now I'll put some samples up there of that. We start with some simple monochromatic paintings. If you want to get further into painting, I suggest you take art too, but this is where we start. This is where we start everything in art one. We start not just painting, but talking about why colors work, how colors work. We incorporate a little art history here and there as needed. So you're getting a pretty well-rounded um, experience in art one, as well as a good vocabulary so you can discuss art. Aside from these, we do colored pencil, colored pencil animals, hopefully of your own pet if you have one. Um, we do perspective. We also, do a little bit of ceramic and photography because so those are two directions you can take within the art department. Our photography department is very popular. They uh, learn both digital and traditional photography. So in Art One, we do one project where we take you into the dark room and you learn how to use the equipment in there. You expose an image. It's, it's a lot of fun for the kids. And we also do one ceramic class and one ceramic project in Art One generally. Try to do two, three D projects all together, but. We do do a ceramic. We haven't been able to do that this year because of COVID and uh, being at home. If you take ceramics, you did ceramics this year, but we just, it's too inconvenient for us to do one project in our one uh, in this current situation. Same with dark room. There's no dark room to take you in. It's all been digital while we're in COVID, but every reason to think we'll be back in school next year at some point, I hope at the beginning. And if that is the case, there is no reason why I don't see we won't be doing a little bit of photography and ceramic in our one again and bring that back. Um, so as I'm speaking, I hope you're looking at the images above. It's a it's a great experience, and if if this if you want if the art is your thing, if you want to be an art major, this is where you're gonna go. Well, this is a great place to start because as you move up uh, through the system, we go know we get to know more about you. You get to know about us, and we work with a lot of the big art schools in, around the country. Uh, we can help you out. Some kids don't even know that art is their thing until they get to Art One. Now, I'm not telling you that you that you have to come and be a good artist, be an art major. Plenty of kids just come take Art One or Art Two or Art Three or Four. They go that far, and that's all it is. It's just for the experience here at school. There are no future plans. Just telling you that options out there, and we've had a lot of success in that direction. So I hope you're interested. I hope uh, you take some time to look at some of the inches, uh, images. Uh, I'll also put a link below on the Facebook link, uh, not Facebook, excuse me, YouTube link, which I hope this brings you to. Uh, information below where you can go look at some more of our work from Art One and the other classes. Um, you can contact me at the email also below, but like all teachers, it's lowercase jay underscore Shelton, S-H-E-L-T-O-N, at F-U-H-S-D dot org. Uh, have any questions? I hope to hear from you and I hope to see you kids in class next year. Thank you.